let's chat about the number one trending comic book on this list because I'm a little I'm a little confused how to feel. The inner turmoil is real. Number one on the list, Russ. Number one on the list, Avengers number eight, first appearance of King the Conqueror. Oh my goodness. We're seeing a pretty pricey book leading the charge for the most wanted comics post news and speculation rumors have been circling about him appearing in the Ant-Man 3 franchise. We have only rumors. We have no confirmation. But what we do know is that Jonathan Majors from Lovecraft Country is now tied to this property. So we have a pretty good idea of where he may be heading. Going to be tied to this? Possibly tied to this character? Could he be this time-traveling menace? Well, this $300 average sale seems about right with this kind of speculation going around. But this is a very expensive book in high grade. So let's tell you about this crazy 9.4 CGC graded copy. $3,960 for a CGC 9.4. And for a Silver Age book, you know that's a great grade and probably even undervalued for the market. To put in perspective, a 7.5 copy of this book would likely go between seven dollars to $800 this time a year ago. That same grade is approaching $1,500. But this is all within a 48-hour time frame. People are aggressively hunting for any villain spec they can get their hands on. And this one's actually pretty cool because there's actually two Silver Age books to consider. Fantastic Four 19, actually the first appearance of Rama Tut. Well, we find out in Avengers number eight that King the Conqueror was trying to pull a fast one on everyone, and he was actually Rama Tut in Fantastic Four 19. So that book's been moving too. Wouldn't it be so interesting if they decided to go the Rama Tut route? I mean, we do know that Black Adam consider this i know it's a different franchise but they're going to be bringing like an origin story of that character to the screen it's going to be incorporating ancient egypt and the pyramids and stuff why wouldn't marvel try to do something similar like it's would be really cool to see and i like the idea of them going the rama tut route with this and then possibly bringing this mega villain into the mcu because he's going to be appearing in ant-man 3 like i would expect that in like a heist movie well yeah but you know we can time travel with pym particles Oh, that's true. 